Hey everyone, it's Haley. Welcome to Mom Life Vermont. Very exciting, as you saw from the last video. I am in Iowa. Today is actually travel day, but since I'm here a day late, there is no rest for the weary. So we are, I, we, there is a whole group of this. I'm with this crowd here. We are on our way to, I've forgotten the name, but we're walking through downtown Des Moines at the moment. I'm gonna show you a little bit about that, show you a little bit about that, show you a little bit of it. And then I'm also going to show you where we're going. Welcome. I hope you guys enjoy the adventure. If you're all interested in seeing all of the Des Moines videos, be sure to hit the big and red subscribe button and give this video a huge like. Let me know down in the comments. Have you ever been here? What do you guys like to do? What do you see? What do you, I've never been here. This is exciting. This is fun. Come on my adventure. I don't know if that's right. We are going on our adventure. This is a building near me. Has some beautiful grounds. Ooh, there's an earth. This is where we are going. It is the World Food Prize. It's in this very large building. We're gonna go in, check some stuff out. I'm actually pretty excited. I don't really know what it is going to be in there, but seems like it's the place to go. Let's go on inside. Pretty much the World Food Prize is an award, a group of people, an elite society of people who basically work 
and agriculture and nutrition to make the world better. And I mean, I just don't mean like me working in a little office, getting people their food. This who genetically modified corn to make it protein, more have more protein in it. So it's pretty amazing stuff. Absolutely fascinating going in there. If you ever happen to come to Des Moines and are looking for something to do, highly suggest taking a look here. There's also some beautiful gardens on the other side of the building that I showed you. And those are actually part of the Smithsonian Garden Society or something. So definitely check out those, especially if you're here in the summer. Some of the things were a little gone at this point, but still beautiful and still a place to check out. and drinks at this place called the Hub Riverwalk. It was very good. I had a craft beer, not as good as Vermont craft beers, but still good. I am now exhausted. I've been up since about four o'clock in the morning, traveling, and then the stress of my hotel, and now I'm just ready to go take a nap, aka go to sleep for the night get up refreshed tomorrow. Have a fabulous day. I'm not sure what tomorrow will bring, but I'll definitely bring you guys along. Mm, and then just as a reminder, be sure to subscribe, give me a comment, give me a like, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.